Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to the vlog. It is Saturday today. I woke up at an early 7.30 body why i think it's because i get up at like 7 20 for work so now because i've been going to sleep earlier on days when i don't work my body is like hey wake up and i'm like no and it's like but you should so anyways i got up i went for a walk my back <laughs> was like seizing up like my lower back when i was walking so i should probably stretch that or something today because there were a couple points where i was like well i'm gonna just fall over but Got in a brisk, um, was it like three and a half K? Yeah, that's what it was. So that's good. It was a struggle, but I was like, I was like, I'm just going to do one K. And I was like, I'll just do two K. And I was like, okay, just go until you hit two and a half K. And then wherever you are on your way back, that, that, that'll be it. So oh, we did it because again, construction. So it's not like I walked two and a half K and then I came back and it was somehow only three and a half K. But anyways, so... I am now sitting here at my desk. I've got my laptop back here. I've got my breakfast drink ready to go. My sewing machine is set up. I've like de sweatified a little bit from the walk. <laughs> and now I think I'm going to just finish listening to this chapter in the audiobook I'm listening to. It is Predator's Gold by Philip Reeve. It's the uh, second book in the Mortal Engines series, if you were wondering. And um, yeah, just gonna finish listening to that and then switch to some YouTube, maybe scroll a little bit and then get into sewing. All my Christmas scrunchies and then also this pattern that I didn't have um, matching thread for are now sewn. I just have to cut the thread. The only scrunchie I have that is not sewn is this owl one here. Mostly because I keep forgetting that it's there when I have my machine set up and I just need to grab the thread and I don't. The sewing machine is chilling over there. I put all the thread away. I still need to make my bed but we're mostly organized up in here which is exciting. It is just quarter after 11 so I think we go make myself some lunch and then I might shower maybe. Oh I also bought myself the pajama pattern for the fabric that I bought ages ago, which is this stuff here. It's just been sitting here waiting for me to make it, but I just really haven't had time, which has been super sad. And I was thinking like, I'm gonna finish these scrunchies and then I have more masks to make and then people want Christmas masks. Like when am I gonna get to embroider and also make the pajamas for myself? So I don't know, we'll see. Hopefully things will slow down because <laughs> I really just want those pajamas. It's been like a year in the making since I first saw that fabric and was like, I need this. Anyways, I'm gonna go make myself some food and then um, I guess cut some thread afterwards. All very exciting things. You know, at one point today, I actually thought I was gonna change into like real clothes and by real clothes, I just mean nicer sweatpants <laughs> that aren't like two days old or like, I don't know, they need to be washed in any case and they're covered with thread naturally you maybe can't see that but it is thread so it has been quite a while since I last picked up the camera because I've just been like being productive I guess slash also playing video games in between I don't know weird mood today so I finished all my Christmas scrunchies I finished sewing them all they're all good to go Tomorrow I think I will take pictures of them and get them posted into my store so that is exciting I do already have an order of Christmas scrunchies from bubs though so I need to pack that up but I think I need to print more tags in order to pack it up so right now I'm <laughs> sitting down with my agenda because uh, I want to kind of reassess the next couple days I think is what I need to do and right now it's only seven o'clock and I'm like really conflicted as to what I should be doing so I need to figure out what I'm doing tomorrow so I can figure out what I need to do today very exciting I also managed to sew all these masks, so I pinned them earlier today. This one over here is for me, the wizard one. Um, I pinned them all earlier today, and then I sewed them and I flipped them all and they're now pinned and ready to sew, like top stitch around and then finish them. So I might do that today. Um, I don't think I'm gonna worry about my bed. I might make it, probably not, because like as much as I love that weighted blanket, you can't like, you know how normally when you have a blanket and you like flip it up and it settles down nicely, you try to flip this up and just boom. <laughs> and not good. Anyway, so yeah, currently trying to figure out what to do. I think I need to like make a list of all the things I need to accomplish and then go from there. 
<laughs> I did buy my pajama pattern today. I think I was mentioning it earlier. Had I bought it at that point? Anyways, I was taking a look at it. I'm like, well, this looks very complicated. It's been a very long time since I followed like a legitimate pattern for anything. So it'll be interesting. Anyways, I'm gonna take a pause from the talkie talkie part here and figure out what I'm doing. bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me We're meant to be In the great outdoors Is 10.20 at night the time to be like, wait, do I have a vlog going up tomorrow? Apparently it is because I just had that moment. I do, which I knew I did, but I don't know, I just panicked. Anyways, I got five masks done here. I just got to trim off the excess thread and do the elastic. And then I have another seven. This one's for me, but I have another seven here that I just have to make the channels on, which is very exciting. I have the hiccups right now, which is less exciting. I packed up. Bubs's uh, scrunchies as you saw and then as you probably also saw I've got the massive pile of Christmas scrunchies there. I did do the inventory on them so that's good. I just need to take pictures and list them now. I'm like looking at my list that I stuck on the wall. So tomorrow I'll finish the masks. I should hopefully do that and then we'll do a bunch of editing before I get on to the next set of mask orders. I think that's the best way to go. But I think I'm gonna go to sleep now because I'm an old lady now and it's 10.30 and it's bedtime. So with that, I'm going to say thanks for coming along on today's adventure, <laughs> if it was that. And I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.